Well, we're now at day 12 of the protest outside here at Lloyd's. Keep going, mate. And today, Lloyd's are obviously getting worried by what we're doing. As you can see, there's an Arctic lorry in front of our stand and they've been moving more bits out of the Lloyd's offices. The lorry must have been there now a good two hours. So they're obviously worried. We've also got with us today Frances May. She's doing a very good job over there, letting people know about the frauds. We've also had um, notice from Anthony Stansfield, the police crime commissioner of Thames Valley, that in the Times today, there is an article about criminal banking fraud of Lloyds Bank about forged signatures. And Anthony really lets rip about the serious fraud office sitting on the backsides and that sort of thing. So um, to think that Lloyds are now going to this sort of effort, hey, they must be worried. On Tuesday, we've got Anthony Stansfield joining us when we'll be down at the Cannon's house um, down by the harbour in Bristol where the um, protests will come to an end around about 12 o'clock. So if you're in Bristol, you want to meet Anthony Stansfield and find out more about the frauds that are happening, please come and find us. The guys that have got the lorry, got chatting to one of them, really lovely guy. He said, I'm OK, I've got a Halifax account. I said, well, that's part of Lloyd's. I've just told him to go and buy a Times. I think he's about to go and close the account. So well done for bringing us another one of your customers, Lloyds. It's just about to leave you. More later.